Holy cow, it's a nice man, bro. Holy smolies, come on, gotta get this guy up. Holy cow, look at the size of that guy. Man, that's a nice man, bro. Snapper right there. <laughs> He's taking drag too. I think it's a big man rope. That's what I think it is. And he's like really good. Look at that. This guy up. Holy smolies, it's a big man rope. Look at that guy. Holy cow. That's a nice man rope right there. What a beautiful fish. Hey everyone, welcome back to another edition of Saltwater Fishing Tampa. My name is Scott. Today is Monday, January 10th, and we're out at the Skyway Bridge. Imagine that. <laughs> and we're fishing for it. Not mangroves, but uh, we're going after uh, sheephead. I mean, this is the time when they spawn. They move in from December, and they stay in the bay until about March, and they're spawning. So we're going after the sheephead, and we're going after grunts. And, you know, we're going to get some mangroves. Oh, you could. And you're going to get the occasional uh, gag grouper, and uh, you can keep the reds now up to 20. they got to be 20 inches, though. So, but anyways, look at this beautiful beautiful sunrise tampa bay look at that there's the skyway bridge i'm at the southwest rock pile here look at all the pelicans standing there man i tell you and uh just a beautiful day today there's some storms out uh, in the gulf right there and they'll be moving in but they're far away there hopefully we'll have some fish in the cooler by then and we can get out of here you know <laughs> but anyways man i tell you it's nice to be back out here it's been almost two weeks you know between the work and the wind you know and the weather <laughs> It's just tough to get out, but it's great to be out on Tampa Bay. So what we're doing today is uh, I've got some live shrimp. I went to O'Neill's, and, and during the week they have um, they have five dozen for eleven bucks. These are, this is a perfect size right here for going after uh, sheephead. I love that size, and I'm going to be using a jig right here on my Sarah Goose. I have a jig right there. I have my five aught yellowtail snapper jig. And right here, just a knocker rig right there. Three-eighths uh, slip sinker with a uh, with an offset uh, Mustad Ultra Sharp hook. Oh, that's really good right there. So that's what we're going to be using today, whatever they want. The live shrimp, and I got some frozen shrimp here. These are really good. Got them at the Asian market. They really stay on the hook, I tell you. And cut up a bunch of squid. That's for grunts, Key West grunts. Man, I tell you. <laughs> like I said, these guys are so forgiving. You put this on the hook, if you pull out of their mouth, just leave it there. Uh, they'll bite until you catch them or they take it off the take it off the hook so that's pretty good so i have that and we're going to be casting out toward this rock pile here now if the dolphins start to bother me i'll be moving around I'll, I'll move over to the columns there and if not then i'll move out to the uh the channel by that first red right return buoy out there there's rock piles right along the channel and i have the rodan working here that's pretty good look at this thing is just anchoring right up good here, keeping me right where I want want to. And I always have the anchor for a backup. So that's what we're doing today. We're going after sheephead and Key West grunts. If we get any mangroves, oh, that's just a bonus, you know. So anyways, hope you enjoy the show. Give me a thumbs up or like. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. So you know what we do next? Let's catch some fish. Well, I moved over by the columns here because there's just too many dolphin out here. I'm about the only boat out here. And um, here I switched to a, uh, a jig here and uh, I'm just tossing it out. The tide's still coming in, so I'm going to toss this right out that way. And I got the Rodan anchored right there. He's doing his thing. And just keep me right here and I'm just going to flick it right out there. Just going to give it a toss. Just an underhand toss like that. Just like that. And let it go down that way right to that, uh, to that column right there. And that's where I've gotten a lot of good sheephead, a lot of mangroves. So we'll see what happens. Those dolphins are really pesky guys. At Port Manatee, they didn't bother me, but over here, oh yeah, they're hungry. They don't want to work for their meal. I don't want to give them my fish. Oh, oh something's bite. Come on, come on, come on. Sheep head, look at that. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I believe that's a big sheep head or a mangrove. I do fight like a mangrove. Ha <laughs> ha, come on, let's get him. Let's get this guy up. Holy smolies, it's a big mangrove, holy cow. Look at the size of that guy. Man, I tell you. Holy cow. Oh, that's nice. Nice to get a mangrove out of here. He's about 12 and a half inches long. Beautiful looking guy. Got him on that jig. And I tell you, look at him. He won't, he won't let go of that. I tell you. Look at him. Nice guy. Let's get a measurement on him. And I'm pretty happy, I tell you. Oh, <laughs> look at I'm always... <laughs> These guys are always jumping. Hey man, look at this. Let's 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 get the check it stick on this frisky guy here. Man, look at that. Got him on that three eighths ounce jig. Let's see it. Look at that. Twelve and a half inches long. Real nice, beautiful looking mangrove. Man, I like that. Got him right out here. 
just with a live shrimp, let it, tossed it right out there, let it hit the bottom and bounce, bounce. Man, he hit it. I thought it was a sheephead. That's the way they take it, but uh, maybe because of the cool water, but beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful looking fish. Man, I tell you what, I never get tired of catching these guys. You know, my favorite fish. Nice, 12 and a half inches long on the check it stick. Really nice, man. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him. He's snapping. That's why they call them snappers. <laughs> Come on, guy. Beautiful looking fish. Let's get another. Man, I tell you, that's what I like to see. I'm going to take this guy off. Look at him. <laughs> He's going in the cooler. Come on, come on, let go. Got to be careful. I've been bit so many times by these guys. Eh. Oh, yeah, look at that, man. That's good eating right there. <laughs> come on, in you go. Now, I got that mangrove on this uh, 3 8 ounce jig here. Really sharp hooks, like I said. Look at that. I tell you, when it, when it pokes your skin like that, <laughs> that's sharp. But that's what you need. I really want a cheap head, but you know I'll take a mangrove any day. Any day of the week, so... Man, I tell you, right there, just dropped it straight down in there. Water temperature, 67 degrees. Today is Monday. I worked all weekend, so I got today off. Come on, let's get another. That's what we want. Went out to the channel, didn't get nothing there. Too many dolphins around. I let that guy take it, too. He didn't just slam it. He was pecking away at it. Finally got him. Going to give that shrimp a toss out there, just like that. Underhand toss. I like that. I do that all the time my spinning rod this is my uh, 4000 twin power love this rod love this rod love the reel this is a talus my medium fast action 20 to 50 perfect with 30 pound tester lighter i want to get some sheep head out of here too got another mangrove on here not sure but let's just see now holy cow it's a mangrove look at that uh, not the biggest guy but you know mangrove nonetheless i switched to my yellow tail snapper jig look at that <laughs> He's got the shrimp still sticking out of his mouth. Got to be careful. But um, I was using the um, three ounce jig, half ounce jig, got one on, but uh, they were stealing my uh, bait every time. So uh, yeah, and there's some pinfish down here too. Come on, guy, let go. <laughs> got to be careful, these guys. Look at that. Nope, there you go. But uh, he's probably only 10 inches, but you know what? Mangrove nonetheless. Look at that. <laughs> Come on. Look at this guy. Come on, man. Look at these guys. Look at him. There's my uh, dolphin pinger. Come on, let's <laughs> let's see what we got here. Look, at I just can't get a hold of the guy. Come on, come on, guy. <laughs> he almost went out. Oh my god. They're really frisky guys. Let's see this guy. Yep. Well, he's almost 11 inches long. <laughs> let's see if he'll stay. Yep. Not bad. You know what? He's a keeper, and he's fat too. Look at that man. Good looking mangrove. Look at look at his eyes. Like he's looking down. Really like these guys. Got him right out here on my yellow tail snapper jig. So I'm gonna try for another. Come on, let's get another. These online. These are uh, 50 yellow tail snapper jigs. Kind of um, kind of heavy duty looking, but um, you know I'm gonna give it a shot. These look pretty good. I'm gonna put a live shrimp on here and uh, give it a try. Those, those these are five O's. I found them online. There's, I think there's about uh, 20 of them in here, and it was about $17.99. Not bad. So I'm going to give these a shot. I'm right by that baller there, and I got that mangrove on my yellowtail snapper jig, and I just tossed it out like that. And uh, let's just see what happens. I came out here for sheep head, but I'll take mangroves any day of the week. Oh, yeah. Come on. Man, I'm the, <laughs> I'm the new yellow tail snapper jig with that big five on hook. Oh, it's another mangrove. Holy moly. That's the third one. Man, I tell you. Nice. Come on. Come on, guy. <laughs> look at that. See? Look at that. That's a big, that's looks like it's bigger than a 5 -oh, but And I don't even know if he's legal, but uh, I don't think so. He's probably got to go back. But no, it's nice to catch him. That's a heavy-duty hook right there. No, he's not legal. I'm sure of that. So... He's gonna have to. Oh, look at this guy. Look at him. He said, I wanna go back. I wanna get in. Oh my gosh. Come on, guy. They're always doing that. Holy smokes. Come on, let's just see. Oh my gosh. He just makes it. You know, look at him. He just makes it. Holy cow. I wanna get some bigger mangroves. He's legal, but hey, they're really good eating. I tell you, if this was a grunt, 
I'd keep this guy, but man, I tell you, let's get another. A lot of shrimp on that. I just got that 10 and a half inch mangrove. And look at that. Doesn't that look appetizing there? Oh, I tell you, let's, <laughs> let's just give it a flick out here. Wind's starting to pick up. Just tossing it right out there, and it's uh, that eighth ounce is uh, taking it right down there. Looks like it's bigger than an eighth of an ounce, but uh, you know, that's a big, big heavy duty hook. But it's, it's getting the mangroves. Come on, let's get another. I come out here for sheephead, but I'll take the mangroves any day of the week. You know, when all else fails, switch to the yellowtail snapper jigs with the light line and the uh, fluorocarbon leaders. I'm using 25 pound fluorocarbon leaders. They really, uh, they really hit on that. Mangrove on, holy cow! Oh, I hope this is a nice one. Oh my gosh, look at this. Come on, look at that guy. Haha, <laughs> I wonder if it's a sheephead. Let's just see what we got. Holy cow, it's a nice mangrove. Holy smolies, come on, gotta get this guy up. Holy cow, look at the size of that guy. Man, that's a nice mangrove snapper right there. <laughs> look at that guy. Beautiful. He's probably 14 and a half inches long. Look at that guy. Oh, look at that. And he hit on that uh, yellowtail snapper jig on a live shrimp. Let's get this guy up. And I tell you, ho -ho, that's a nice mangrove snapper right there. Beautiful. Holy smolies. That's what we come out here for. And I love them. Just love these guys. Let's get a measure on them. Let's get a measure on this guy. He's hooked really good. So <laughs> come on, come on, guy. Look at that. Let me see, hold it. Let me get that nose right there. 14 and a half inches long. Yep, yep. You know, it's about a quarter inch there. And he's almost at 15, so he's a 14 and a half inch mangrove. Beautiful fish, man, I tell you. Now nah, that's just beautiful. Look at that, I was using these jigs and, and switched and I was using other jigs and I got these, the five O's. I just found these online. I'm gonna put a link for that. And uh, 25 pound Seaguar. Tried these two, got one on that. <laughs> you see all the different uh, yellowtail snapper jigs I got. Yeah, I tell you what, look at look at that big hook, man. And he hit that. You need that for these guys. Man, just a beautiful fish. I tell you, that's what we like to see. <laughs> I, I try to hold him for the camera, and uh, <laughs> he's wanting to jump out. But uh, that's it. Beautiful mangrove snapper. Let's get another. Take it. Come on. You know you want it. Come on. Come on. Just take it. Take it. Take it. Just run with it. Come on. Got him. Got him. Oh, look at that guy. <laughs> That's what we love. Come on. Hope it's a mangrove. Holy smolies. It's another mangrove. Holy cow. Man, I tell you. <laughs> Not the biggest, but man, it's it's January and getting some mangroves out of here. Man, I tell you. <laughs> but you know, this is the size you're going to get out here in January. So, but I'm, I'm happy with this guy. Look at that. Look at that big hook. Man, look at it. Let's get a measurement on him so I know he's not gonna, I'm not gonna lose the guy. Oh. <laughs> look at this, hey, they're always jumping. Well, man, they're they're just so active. They're just such an, they're just such an active fish that that's what they do. Jeez, <laughs> come on, come on. Hold still for the camera. Yeah, he's 11 and a half inches. We'll flip him around so he looks good. Come on. You can see all my jigs out there. You can see my jigs out here. Yep, now he's 11 and a half inches long. Oh, I tell you, nice. I'm gonna try for some others, but I'm gonna probably put them in the cooler, but real nice fish. Love these mangroves. Look at all the different jigs I have. Love these scissors too, these are great. Anyways, let's get another. Look at that guy. Man, beautiful. I wait till the dolphins go away. But when I fish the columns here, you only see a dolphin and they pass right by and go away, but they'll never hang out here. So I just stopped fishing. I'm just gonna toss this guy right out there, just like that, and it's sinking down here and going this way. This is where I've been getting the mangroves. I know I've lost a few too. That's pretty good for January mangroves here. Come on, let's see if we can get another here. I come out here for sheephead and I'm getting mangroves. <laughs> Look at that, see how I just hold it like this? Just, just natural appearance of it, just drifting in the current here. And the mangroves, they love it. Going after these shrimp, man, that's a good meal for them. Come on. Come on, always oh, taking drag too. I think it's a big mangrove. That's what I think it is. And he's fighting really good, look at that. And I tell you, oh, let's see, let's get this guy up. Holy smolies, it's a big mangrove. Look at that guy, holy cow. That's a nice mangrove right there. Man, I tell you. Oh, look at that. What a beautiful fish. 
and look what I got him on. That yellow tail snapper jig. That big, that big cantankerous 5-0 hook. Look at that. Beautiful. He's good 13 inches. Whoa! Whoa. Hang on, guy. <laughs> Let's give him a measure. I always like to measure these guys. Come on. Man, that's nice. That's really nice. Man, love these guys. Look at them. Just a beautiful fish. Man, look at this guy. Come on. Come on, guy. Oh, yeah. I got to hold on to him. <laughs> you know, look at him. Just snapping. Yep. 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 Look at that. He's Come on. <laughs> he's on the end of this. So we'll just, let's see. He's probably going to jump anyway, but let's just put him out here. <laughs> yeah, he's 13 and a half inches long. Just a beautiful fish. Look at that guy. Man, I tell you, that's a gorgeous mangrove snapper. Man, I tell you, that's turning out to be a good day today. <laughs> he come off the hook. This guy come off the hook. Holy smolies. Yep, I got to get him in the cooler. Yep, he's going in the cooler. Oh, I better be careful. Look at how fat he is. Look at that. Look at that fat. That guy's really fat. <laughs> I don't want to hold him up too high because he may jump out. Beautiful mangrove snapper. Man. Let's get another. Let's put him in the cooler here. <laughs> get in there, guy. I've been using this big uh, 5 yellow yellowtail snapper hook here. <laughs> Just plain old lead on there. That's kind of a big, thick hook, but uh, I've been getting mangroves on this thing. So, uh, and a real short leader, too. Yep. Well, I've been getting frayed off and cut off, but i just been flicking it right out there. Just letting it sink. The tide's going out, just like this and just doing it the same way I've been doing it all uh, summer long, all summer and fall. I the bollards, and it seems the dolphins are always here. So, but I'm gonna try it here. Something, something's on here. Come on, come on, come on. Might be a sheephead the way he's pulling like that. Come on. They like to, they like to just pull on this thing. Come on, I wanna get a nice sheephead today. Come on, see that? Come on, see that there's something on there. Oh, oh. Yep, yep. oh yeah, come on, come on. That's usually a sheephead that does that. <laughs> oh yeah, it's a sheephead. See that guy? Look at that. There's a sheephead. I don't know if he's a keeper. They got to be 12 inches, but you know, <laughs> that's what I really come out here for. But uh, that's the second sheephead today, and that's what they do. They, they run with it. Yeah, I don't think he's a keeper, but they run with it, these guys. And look at, I got them on that yellow tail snapper jig too. But uh, man, they're really good eating. I mean, I think it's a highly underrated fish and, and you're allowed to eat of these guys. But uh, I want to measure them up. Look at, the, look at those teeth on them too. And he took that jig right in there. Look at that. See that? He took that jig right in there. Look at the teeth. Boy, I tell you. But let's, let's give a measure with this guy. They got to be 12 inches. I don't think he's there. I always like to put them on the check it stick. Yep. Just for fun. Oh, he's really tensing up. Come on, come on, guy. It's okay. No, he doesn't make it, but a real nice fish. See, they gotta be, oh, yeah, if you squeeze his tail. But you know what, I'm gonna toss him back. He actually makes it, but he's gonna go back. I wanna get a big guy, it's probably a female. I don't wanna mess with them. Go on in there. I came by the columns here, what's the only got? Oh, we got a sheephead, holy smolies. He looks like he's legal too. <laughs> Man, I tell you, yep, this is the third one today. Man, look at that. Yeah, he's probably 12 and a half, 13 inches. Let's just see. Let's look at the, let's look at this guy. You know, he, they just run with it. They don't really bite. Um, they just kind of run with it. So uh, let's just see. Let's let's get this guy off here. Oh, let's get a measure on this guy. Man, I already got my limit of mangroves. I'd like to get some sheephead. These are really good eating. Let's see if I can't keep this guy in the boat. <laughs> oh man, I tell you, let's just see. Yeah, he's 13 inches long. So uh, he's not bad. Now at 13 and a half, that's not a bad sheep bed. I mean, it's the only one I got. I really love these filleted. Oh, they make good hot <laughs> fish fries. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on. Holy smolies. That guy's just jumping around. Let's see if we can get some more. Look at that, <laughs> look at the mouth on that guy. So uh, I think I'll keep this guy. I'm gonna try him for another one here. They're right down there. I'm just using shrimp with my uh, yellow tail snapper jig, but beautiful looking sheephead. Let's get another. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, sheephead. <laughs> Come on, take it. 
you know you want it. Come on, got to play with these guys. And and the current's really going, tide's really going out today too. Like they're just mouthing it. That's what they do. Come on, come on, guy. Just take it in, take it in, take it in. Put a little bit of tension on him here. Oh, 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 there we go. See, I told you. <laughs> there we go. That's a sheephead. That's what they do. <laughs> they just play with it. You saw how he did that. This guy, I think, is too small, but you see how they play with that. They just, they're grabbing it on the run right there. Yep, yeah, he's a small one, but that's all they're doing is just playing with it. And uh, let's get a big one. Come on. Well, I think we had a pretty good day on Tampa Bay today. I was using live shrimp uh, and I uh, was using jigs and then finally ended up switching to my yellow, yellow tail snapper jig. <laughs> you know, my, my standby that I use all the time now. But anyways, let me show you what I got. Got, look at that. Man, these are some nice mangroves here. Yeah, I got some 10 and a half, 11 inches here, but, and then a 12 and a half and a 12 and a half. I think it's about 13 inch sheep head, but really nice i caught the about two or three of the 12 inches decided to keep the one i really love these guys filleted but man look at this big fat mangroves look at that man the nice and i know i lost some too of course i always do that lost some sheep head too but really what a great day today and and uh man i tell you look at look how orange the guys are really orange holy smolies i really like that and what a great day yeah i mean i came out today and i haven't been out for a while since uh I was out in Port Manatee, and I went out the last day of grouper season, didn't get anything, you know, but that's the that's fishing, so, you know, it's all about just having fun out on Tampa Bay, and that's exactly what I did then, and that's what I did today, so I want to thank everybody for showing up, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, give me a thumbs up for a like, and until next time, this is Scott with Saltwater Fishing Tampa, happy fishing.